Hi, this is Rebecca from Journal Tsunami. Uh, continuing on our journey through the different keyword research tools that I use to help me get ideas for my low content books. Um, over the course of time, there's going to be about 20 of these videos, primarily because there's so many different tools that are out there. Obviously, this isn't even all the tools. This is literally just the tip of the iceberg. But it really kind of gives you an idea of the types and variety of tools that are on the internet uh, through using Google um, that can just give you ideas. One of the biggest questions I have in my groups are how do I get ideas for my books? And if you just understand how to use Google, um, then you really can understand that the world is your oyster. And by using Google and Amazon, you can have a, a wealth of information at your fingertips. This tool I'm going to talk about today is called Suvli. I don't know where the word comes from. I don't know why they named it that, but it is uh, just a very handy little tool because it covers a lot of different searches. So Suvli, S-O-O-V-L-E, you just type that into Google, it'll come to suvli.com. When you click on it, it takes you to this little page right here. And now you'll notice that there's a bunch of different places right here all around it. When I type in, we're going to use our word that we've been using, journals for women. And the neat thing that we have here is because we have added keywords everywhere already to our Chrome, which is a tool we talked about some time ago at the very beginning. This is giving me the keyword results. So this is Google. It's showing me in Amazon some of the different words that come up from the auto suggest tool. These are the words that are in Bing. Apparently people don't really search for that term in YouTube very much. And then these are the terms that are in answers.com. Um, and so this gives me a couple of different ideas. Are journals for all ages? Uh, so I might take a look. How do you search on search the online journals for plant? I don't know what that means. Um, then there's answering journals for women's health, journals for women's health, uh, journal for women, this is Bing, um, in films, with locks, because diaries have locks, with journals for women with quotes on the pages. So that would tell me about prompt journals, perhaps. So that would be something to think about. And then again, we have the Amazon Suggest here, prayer journals, writing journals, leather journals, inspirational journals, beautiful journals, engraved journals, best journals for women, inspirational journals. And so again, it's just a place to type in a keyword um, and we can type in journals for, and if we type in A, then we can get return for anxiety for all. And this is a great place to do your journals for and scroll for, through the alphabet. Journals for B, Bible study, business, beginners, bullet journaling, bookkeeping, biochemistry, um, and just scroll through the alphabet. Obviously, we can replace journals with planners. We can replace diaries for and scroll through the alphabet and just get a ton, a ton of ideas. And again, we're looking for uh, the research that we get from keywords everywhere telling us journals for computer science. So that's interesting. Journals for cheap, journals for college students. Um, and now this is also returning YouTube results. So that's kind of cool, cool ideas for journals. So that's a great idea. If you're like me and making videos, uh, this is going to give me ideas for videos that I can make for people. So cool ideas for journals would be a great video topic for me to do something about. Um, so hopefully you've seen the value of this Suvli tool. Uh, in helping you get seed keyword ideas. Obviously, when you click up, when you 
get these keyword ideas, you want to dive deeper down into um, where you're researching. And when you click on it, it will take you to that particular source so that you can actually start diving down into your keywords. Okay, so uh, suvli.com is the place to go. Hopefully you've enjoyed that, and hopefully I'll see you in my free Facebook group, or uh, maybe you'll join my paid mastermind where we talk about not just creating journals, but also how to sell our low-content books, because that's sort of the whole name of the game, isn't it? Have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.